speaks. I'd like to share with you a few images as an introduction. I hope these images will echo in your minds throughout the Deputy Director General's message, throughout this forum, and even beyond. Recently, I was in Japan and China for the annual Media Information Literacy and Intercultural Dialogue Week. In fact, the Media, Information, Media and Information Literacy and, and Intercultural Dialogue Week was the product of excellent partnership, similar to the partners who are hosting this Latin America and the Caribbean MIL Forum. While in Japan, I met a professor, Mr. Shin Mitsukoshi. I would categorize him as an expert in media and information literacy. He gave me a copy of his book titled Designing Media Ecology. It's an excellent book. The only title, only thing I would change is the title. It should have read Media and Information Ecology. I want to say a lot more about this book, but let me get to the point. On the cover of this book, there's a big image of the digit five. You can see an overhead projector. I think we have over 30 countries represented here this morning, and I can suppose over 20 languages. So I want you to do an exercise with me, all right? Um, I'm going to ask us to count to five, but you should count to five in your own local language. It could be in your inter indigenous language, all right? So can we do a quick, quick rehearsal? After three, one, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, was it so bad? Next slide, please. Now the book starts with an infographic, and this in infographic is the representation of five. Next slide. So the first one is the Arabic numeral five. Can we count? In your own language. One, two, three, four, five. Next slide. The next representation is used in Europe, Australia, and North America. Next slide. This representation of five is also used in France, Spain, and South America. Next slide. Five, this is the Chinese character for five. Next slide. Again, we're in Latin America and the Caribbean. This is the Mayan numerals, representation of five. Can we count to five in our own languages? One, two, three, four, five. And finally, the next slide, please. How to cut a cake, representation of five. Now, what is the message here? Many thoughts may be coming to your mind. Two points before the Deputy Director General speaks. One, the first one is, each of these representations of five, as well as the effective use of each image, is a complete truth. Note I said, complete truth. My second point is a question. But are all representation of information and media content and their effective uses complete truth? I repeat the question. But are all representations of information and media content and their effective uses complete truth? Media information literacy is about a search for truth. Truth about intercultural dialogue. Truth about peace. Truth about interreligious dialogue. Truth about equality between women and men. Truth about sustainable development goals beyond 2050. Ladies and gentlemen, with this, I invite you to welcome the UNESCO Deputy Director General, who recently knows that people need the competencies of media information literacy to deal with the internet. He further calls for media information literacy to be anchored in the curriculum of all schools and be a part of everyday lifelong learning. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Getacho Ngida, Deputy Director General of UNESCO.